Fashion Friday and the future of fashion is digital. That includes how you store and organize your clothing. So here with tips on how to digitize your wardrobe is Julianne Cost again. <laughs> because you are organized like that. When I said to the audience, when I think of digitizing your clothing, I do think of Clueless and Cher's closet. And that her being able to just do, do, do put yes. together different combinations. The fact that that is a real thing we can do is phenomenal. Why should we consider digitizing our wardrobes? Yeah, it's absolutely real, and I'm always surprised at how many people actually haven't done it yet because yeah. it's so incredible. Yeah. Um, you know why we haven't done it yet. I know it's time consuming. We're lazy. Yes, yes. but it's worth it. It okay. is worth it. I believe you. So digitizing your closet is so great because you can track your inventory, which I think is something that often gets lost as mm -hmm. we're consuming clothing. So you can know everything from the brands, the sizing, the colors that you have in your closet, all in your phone 24 seven. Yes. Um, also, a lot of us have small closets or should I say very full closets, right. regardless of the size. <laughs> and it's nice to be able to see everything that you own in an app visually different from it all hanging. So you can wear more of what you own, which I think always feels really good. Yes. I digitized my own closet about five years ago. Yeah. And I'm continuing to do it as I buy things each year. Um, and it's just such a great resource. It makes getting dressed more fun and less mm. stressful. And it's also a really um, forward-thinking way to use our closet, which typically has been used in a very archaic way, I would say, as the rest of our house digitizes. That's the one area that hasn't been yet. That's interesting. That you, And it's true. Yes. Well, like we our fridges can be digital. Our light bulbs right. are digital. But our closet, has we've Not been using so it the same way for Decades. For decades. Okay, mm -hmm. so um, you help your clients do this. Oh my gosh, your clients are so lucky to have you. What has their response been like when you go through the whole thing and digitize their wardrobe? So when we are working with our clients, we're making these recommendations of you know what to wear mm -hmm. um, and telling them how to wear it, which is where we really provide value, but often that gets lost after we leave them or leave the yes. dressing room when they're trying things on and they forget. So this closet is great because it holds all of that information. We can show clients, okay, buy this item and wear it these different ways, and here it is all visually yes. in an app. And we, you can also have access to us 24-7, technically, because we yes. can log into your closet yeah. At any time. You should never tell people that. I know. Can I know. But I just did. It's 3 a.m. I have a meeting tomorrow. Julianne, what we, do I do? We get those texts, and if I happen to wake up, right? I You're can log in. It. Yes. Oh, my yeah. goodness. Okay, so let's go through the process. How do we start to digitize our wardrobe? Okay, so the first thing you have to do is choose the app that you want to use. There's plenty okay. of options out there. The three that we like are Stylebook, Smart Closet, and Cladwell. Okay. Um, they all are a very affordable investment starting at $3.99 up to $7.99 as a one-time fee. Oh, so really that's easy. Good. Yeah. yeah. So the next thing you have to do is photograph your closet. This mm. is the most daunting, time-consuming part. Mm -hmm. um, so we're going to break it down. The first way you can do it is actually take a photograph. So what you want to do is make sure you have a great light source. So when yeah. you take it, it looks like the garment. Yeah. Um, and you also want to make sure that the background that you're photographing on has um, is contrasting because they have these background remover tools mm. um, that you need a contrasting background in order to do so. So that's okay. option one. Option two yeah. is add the item into your closet via a photo that you've taken from the website where you bought the garment. So right. last week I bought this blazer. That's nice. Yeah, from Zara. And luckily Zara has great imagery on their website. Yes. So we are going to add that into my closet because okay, I haven't done that yet. Let's see how you do that. Okay. Yeah. Um, add an item. Choose from album. I've already saved the image in my photo album. Select, cool. done. It auto um, has these different background tools, remover tools, so okay. it auto selects fill. I like that one. You hit the background, boom. Oh, nice. So it goes, it basically now makes it contrasting. Can you do that yes. one more time? Um, let me see. Yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> there we go. Um, yeah, there it is. Yeah, and so that it's removed the background. Hit select, now it's done. Okay. Now what's great is you can categorize everything, and I think this is really important when yeah. digitizing. So you can choose category. This is blazer so it files it away so I know that how many blazers I have nice it's Zara you can choose color size you can even put in the price so if you want to know the value I don't want to know sitting the in your closet you can know that <laughs> can you imagine and then you see all the stuff with the tags on it still you're like oh, yes. how much did I spend right but it is good to know if you're gonna resell it right if you see it for cheaper exactly. like all of that stuff yes. yes it's good to know okay so then lookbook this is my favorite part of owning or having a digital closet you can build out all of these looks so you're never 
thinking about what do I wear. Um, so I'm going to quickly put together an outfit. It's very user friendly, so anyone who's not tech savvy, don't stress. I'm not tech savvy myself. I was going to ask you that next. Like, are you super duper techie? But or, no, or it's just super user friendly. Very user friendly. It's like paper dolls. It is. It's very fun. <laughs> this is fun. It is fun. Yes. Um, you could do it on the go while you're sitting on the subway. Oh my or... gosh, what purse is she going to use? So we're going to put in this cute little Michael Kors purse. Okay. Done. Select outfit. Oh my gosh, Created. do we love it? Do we love it? <laughs> we love it. Just come to my house and do that. That's so good. Okay, so you've created, so you can put together different outfits for different situations or even like five ways to wear these pants. Exactly. Um, which is fantastic. Is there anything else we need to know about digitizing our wardrobe or having this in our lives? Because what you're doing is you're giving people their time back. Yes. How much time do we waste sitting there in front of a closet with all the clothes we will ever need, we really don't need any more. Yes. And saying, I have nothing to wear. Exactly. Not right? anymore. You have no excuses if you've got this digital closet you yeah. really you really can't do that really good Julianne I love that you're doing this uh, you also create a monthly digital style guide yes tell us about that okay so the digital style guide it was born during the pandemic when we couldn't see clients in person so we had to um, recreate the experience and offer it digitally to clients okay. so this is a great guide it comes out on a monthly basis anyone can subscribe to it and it includes everything from shopping list we style each piece that we include in it 30 different ways we have 30 outfits <sighs> One outfit a day for an entire month, hair, yeah. beauty, nail recommendations, all of our styling advice in one guide. Yeah. Um, so it's a really great tool. It kind of mimics a lot of what we see here. And if you have a digital closet, you can add those items right in. That's fantastic. Yes. My pandemic closet, you know what it would have looked like? So this tracksuit, this hoodie with these leggings, these pajamas well, for you, the day, these pajamas for night. And you could have texted me and said, how can I restyle these PJ pants? And right? I would have shown you how to do it. You would have been like, wear a white shirt, do a twist in it. Exactly. Like, right? Oh yes. my God, I yes. love you. Thank you, Julie.